Hey YouTube, it's Stove Mods again, your Hobo Stove channel. Today I'm gonna review this giant Hobo Stove. Actually, it wasn't intended for cooking, it's rather a fire pit than a stove. As you can see, there are no holes here, so if I put a pot on there that closes this uh, hole opening, this wouldn't work, but I have a little stove and with this we're gonna do a boiling test. Um, this was a little beer keg, 5 liters, and um, in order to have a grid, I put these metal sticks through there and just place a grid on them. By the way, I'm planning to make a wood gas stove of the same dimensions and of course when I do so I'll make a video of how to do that and of course later a boiling test but now let's uh, proceed with this one Later I'm going to use some bigger chunks to keep this fire going because once I... first of all it's, it's a just a big stove, it's going to need more fuel and once the pot is on I can't feed it because there's no hole for that so the fire should lo last long enough to get the water cooking as usual 500 milliliters and we're gonna measure the wood we need using bigger stuff like that <coughs> so I'm gonna feed it properly and then we'll start Some people might say size doesn't matter, but in this case it totally does. We're at uh, 2 minutes 45 seconds and it starts boiling. I didn't put any more wood into the stove after I put the pot on there. So, 3 minutes now. Just take a look what's happening. Well, you see, you have to make the decision if you want to have a stove that's a quick boiler or something you can take for traveling that fits in your bag. Unless you have something you can fold or something, you will have to make a choice. Okay. 3 minutes 30 seconds. Fire is almost dead. This one worked pretty well. Uh, actually, we only needed 241 grams of firewood to have half a liter water boiling within three minutes. So, again, this is not a lot in my opinion. Um, I hope you enjoyed this. As I said, I'm planning to build a wood gas stove of this size. Um, once I do that I'll let you know so please subscribe to my channel give me likes if you liked it and um, of course if you have any interesting ideas that I should experiment with just let me know. So hope I see you next time. Bye!